So this question comes from Lucas D. Um, I watch almost every video that you post. It's very good. Uh, and you explain that you have a good goal in life. The question is, what do you do in life? So I get this question a lot from you guys and from everybody, really. And the question is, so what, what exactly does Eli do? And the fact of the matter is, Eli does YouTube. Uh, so I've been doing YouTube as my full-time job, like professionally paid um, uh, since uh, for about at least three years, at least three, maybe three and a half years. Um, I've been working on this project overall for about five and a half years now. Uh, so essentially, I am a real geek. I started off in the, the U.S. Army, then I worked off in the enterprise world. I got a crap ton of certifications, MCSE, uh, Avaya, PBX, and Audix, if you know what the hell that is, Cisco, PHP, the whole nine yards. Ended up being a consultant, ended up creating my own little company with, uh, with, with uh, a number of full-time employees, and when the recession came, uh, basically decided it was better to close down my tech business rather than go bankrupt. Uh, essentially, what I had focused on at that time was very valuable up until the minute it was no longer valuable. <laughs> and that's one of the warnings I try to give you guys, because I know this, I know this, is we were making a lot of money doing that very simple, like, break-fix type work. Um, and that was just, it was just raining money, printing money all the way up until the moment that it wasn't anymore. And so essentially what I did was I uh, shut down that, that business with my employees. Um, long story short, ended up trying to do these videos or trying to do the classes. That, that's how I'm famous on YouTube is uh, doing all those tech classes, ended up doing that. One thing led to another, and now I'm doing a number of different things on YouTube. So yes, my full-time job is in fact YouTube. It has been my full-time job for quite a while. Yes, in fact, you do get paid enough to make it worthwhile uh, to be a YouTube professional if you're the right person. Um, and also, yes, I am a tech. I have about 1,600 hours of tech training, lots of experience, so on and so forth. So that's about it in a nutshell. Just so you all guys know, A, I'm a geek, and B, I'm a YouTube professional, and C, if you call me for tech support, I don't answer the phone. I, th that's the thing. I, I actually, uh, I, uh, I send away quite a bit of work now because now that I'm like YouTube famous, I have like all these people that email me saying, we have servers, we have infrastructure, we have this, we're willing to pay your rate. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not willing to accept my rate. I don't care what rate I, I don't care what rate I tell you. I still don't want that money because, um, because it's really nice being a YouTube professional. That's one thing to tell you to, to really warn you guys about. And I try to warn you guys about like being a real tech professional. It, it's a ball buster. I mean, you guys all think it's a joke. You guys think I'm just being like a hard ass or something, but it really is. I mean, you go in there when you're responsible for infrastructure, man, if you make the smallest stupid screw up, you just, you forget to check off one stupid off, uh, stupid ass checkbox, and literally hundreds or thousands of people just drop. <laughs> And so I just, can I do it? Yes, I absolutely can do it. Do I want to do it? If YouTube is paying me enough money, do I want to do it? Uh, the answer would be no.